Assalamu alaikum. How are you all? Hope all of you are fine today. Let's start our language class. Our today's topic is prepositions of time. In our previous class, we have already learned about prepositions of place. Okay. Uh, can you tell me what is the preposition of place? Who can tell me? Preposition of place indicate a specific place that makes a relationship between a noun or pronoun to another noun or pronoun in the sentence. As saying, the prepositions of time indicates a specific time and it makes a relationship between two noun or pronouns in a sentence. Look, these are prepositions of time. At, in, on. These prepositions indicates a specific time. Like, at sits before night, time, noon, midnight, sunrise, sunset, weekend. At sits before short time, very short time. Like, I get up early at sunrise. And then come to in. In sits before a longer time. Like the morning, the whole morning. When I said I wake up at early sunrise, that means the specific time or a very short time. But when I say in, in the morning, that means the whole time in the morning. So, in sits before the morning, the afternoon, the evening, February. February means month. We can write in before all the months. Spring, summer, winter or 2030 means we can write in before all the years. So, at sits before short time, in sits before long time. Okay, now come to on. On sits before day or date. It's very easy to memorize that on sits only before day or date. Like Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, birthday, holiday, Christmas day, any special day or any date. So, on sits before, say with me, on sits before day or date. Like my birthday is on May 8. Look, my birthday is on May 8. This is a date. That's why on sits before the date. Now, say again with me. At sit before short time. At sits before short time. In sits before long time. In sits before long time and on sits before day or date. At sits before short time, in sits before long time and on sits before day or date. Okay? Sure. Now look, this is four. Four sits before a definite time. Like I am going to bed for two hours. If I mention any specific time like two hours, three days or four hours, we will write four before that time. Now since, since before, uh, sits before indefinite time. Look, if I say it's raining since morning. Uh, here I don't mention the specific time. That's why since sits before the morning. Before, it refers previous time like I was eating before the class or I was running before the class or I was sleeping before the class or after means later time. If I do something, my after work, I will write after before that work. Like I will sleep after lunch or I will eat after the class or I will wash my face after the class. So, what does 
फॉर मीन्स फॉर मीन्स स्पेसिफिक टाइम सिंस सिट बिफोर इनडेफिनेट टाइम बिफोर रेफर्स प्रीवियस टाइम एंड आफ्टर रेफर्स लेटर टाइम ओके लाइक आई विल डू माई होमवर्क आफ्टर द क्लास सो इज इट क्लियर टू यू Who can tell me where does four sits? Four sits before specific time. Since sits before indefinite time, and before refers previous time, and after refers later time. Okay, this is all for today. I have given some exercises on your lecture sheet. Please try to follow the lecture sheet at first, and then write them in your CW copy. This is all for today. Assalamualaikum. Bye bye.